Brian? Yep. I am running out of clever ways to tell people that rates are at all time lows. So what exactly do you mean by that? Well, for 10 years, ever since I've been in the mortgage business, okay. I've been telling people rates are either at historical lows or all time lows. So how the heck would you let people know what these actual all-time record lows mean to them? Actually, I have one more idea to help people understand what these new all-time low mortgage rates really mean. I can only imagine. What exactly is it about? Well, you're about to find out all the other all-time lows in the history of the world that impacted the world the same way that low rates today can impact your finances. I'm Ben Brashen. And I'm Ryan Leopold, and welcome back to a historically low mortgage rate edition, again, of Mortgage Resource TV. Well, Ryan, the world's lowest limbo record in the world was set by Shamika Charles in 2010 at 8.5 inches. Really? I'm taller than 8.5 inches lying down. And that kind of reminds me of some other world records. Like the world record golf score of 55 that's been posted four times. That and Usain Bolt, whose world record 100 meter dash, reminds you of all the people who are speeding to refinance their home loans. <laughs> or the world's longest triple jump in 2008 Olympics of 15.39 meters, which reminds me of the people who've been refinancing three times to get record low interest rates. And just like those athletes who achieved something never before seen, today's mortgage rates are making history as well. All this talk about world records and Olympics kind of makes me want to break a world record right now. <laughs> what, what exactly are you talking about? Man? Well, I'm going to say all time lowest mortgage rates, the most time in history over the course of the next 30 seconds without repeating a sentence. This should be interesting. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Mortgage Resource TV Stadium. Ben Gresham, time to make history by setting a new world record. Well, Ryan, mortgage rates are all time lows, and the all time low rates that people can get now are even lower than last time I talked about all time low mortgage rates. Which begs the question are these all time lows the lowest they'll ever go? I don't know. But last time we talked about all time low mortgage rates, they were not as low as they are today. So you should know at least that they're very low. Although I don't know if they're as low as they'll ever go, they're certainly as low as anyone ever needs to go. And that's why you should lower your rate by refinancing your loan to new historical lows. So go, 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 go to get a mortgage rate at historical lows. Wow, okay. And on another world record, Ben, you've just embarrassed yourself for an amazing 30 seconds, well, that's amazing. <laughs> well, Ryan, it's the last clever way I can tell people about historical lows and break a record at the same time. I get it, so there you have it. Mortgage rates are at all time never seen before lows. So let us know if you want to see what these all time record lows can do for you or your clients. That's it, thank you for watching another episode of Mortgage Resource TV. Ryan, I'm mm -hmm. running out of ways. Clever ways. Just Ryan. read the script. Just read it. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, <laughs> I, I wasn't watching the script. Read the script. So I didn't even look back at the script. I was going back and forth. Right. Do you always practice your goals? Always. Why do you think I'm good? <laughs> Easy. No, it's just with this one, because it was like, I want to do this long thing. You're going to kill my character? <laughs> I was there today. So you should know that they're very low. Although I would understand. Okay, that was pretty good though.